Hello, so in this video, I'm going to explain how to oil a valve. So if you remember from last time, this was the valve that was sticking. It's doing better now, and it is coming out. But we're not going to take our chances and keep playing, because as I put more moisture in there, that's why it's getting stuck, because it's not getting enough oil. So we will take the valve and we will undo this part. Okay? So it's righty tighty lefty loosey. Okay, so once this all the way off, we're going to gently glide it out. And we're going to pay attention. Remember we talked about a number that's written on there? The valve numbers are very important. So mine is written right here on the front facing the bell. So I can now remember that. So the number was facing the bell. That's going to be very important later. So I got my valve out. I've got my oil ready. I can take the cap off. So we're going to get the trumpet ready, kind of maybe hold it with your legs somehow so you can immediately after you oil the valve, put it right in there. So I'm holding my trumpet here, getting it ready. So to oil it, you put a couple of dots, not too much, just in there. It doesn't matter at first how you put it in, just put it in there, okay? and go like this. You don't even really need to do anything. Then let's check to make sure that our number is facing, mine was facing this way. So yours might be facing that way. So you always have to pay careful attention. So mine's facing forward. It is facing forward still. Um, so I'm going to close that up. And I'm going to continue to do this just to help spread the oil. Okay, well, let's try that E, okay? Good. Okay, so now I'm going to pretend that I didn't pay attention. And I'm going to accidentally put it in wrong. Okay, so when I put it in wrong, I just twisted it. Okay, let's try to play the same note. That seems to work. Sometimes I'm just trying to get a scenario here where the valve will not work because you put it in wrong. It will like, when you, when you try to blow into the trumpet, it just won't make any sound. Oh, I got it. So I'm blowing really hard. But I'm getting so much resistance back. So I'm getting nothing. So I put my valve in wrong. I did not break my trumpet. All I gotta do is I'm gonna take out the valve and gently turn it around to the point where that number again was facing the bell. Okay, that's how mine was. So if that's how yours is, then you do the same. If yours is facing a different direction, maybe your mouthpiece or any other direction, then you wanna make sure you put it in exactly the way you took it out. So as you take it out, it is very important to pay attention. Where is that number? Okay, let's try that note. Perfect, so I fixed it, see? I'm going to take out this valve one more time and show you a close up of the number so that you know where to look. Okay, so the number is not written on this part. Usually the number is written on the top part. Just trying to get a good view of it for you. Okay, maybe this is a better angle. See how there's a three written on there? Okay, so there. It's hard to see on the video, but there's a three right there. So the number is usually written on this top part, not this part. I guess you want to be looking up here for the number. Okay, so it's going back in there going to close this up. Um, you don't need to oil your trumpet too much. If you get it out and your keys are a little stuck, just try to work them like this. So, and see if they will play. If you put too much oil, that's bad news too, because your key will get stuck. It's happened before. 
I um, had a student who put too much oil, their key was stuck, and we had to figure out what, the, what the problem was. At first we thought it needed more oil, so we oiled it some more, so we made the problem worse. So, and then I had to clean it all out, wipe it down, and then put just a little bit of oil. So we need just a little bit so it lubricates the inside, so the metal can glide. So these could possibly use just a couple of dots of oil too. And I'll oil them once they get stuck. Since we don't play a lot, uh, we don't want to oil too much. I know some people recommend putting oil in here. I wouldn't do that, okay? I would just stick with taking it out and putting it, putting it in um, the way I showed you. So I'm going to try that mode, see if it works. It works. All right, so perfect. So we worked on valve number three, but you can do the same thing for the other valves in the same way. So this is valve one, two, three. Make sure you also keep them in this order because if you switch around the order of these valves, then it won't work. Okay, <laughs> I hope that was helpful.